Mar uh, Marcus and Molly's mic, and then uh, Radio Headlines card as well, uh, Mike. There's been a massive power failure in Chicago. Three million people about to get uh, Molly blocked. will talk now on the first no headline. Okay, we're about 20 seconds away. See you one come right up on tail. I gotta go, I gotta go. We're talking about lives at okay. stake. Air in a big minor when you get a chance to meet. All right, stand oh, by on the floor, ready to roll four, set this all by B14 under, and ready to headline start with Marley's mind. Roll four. This is all B14 card, Mike Coming Q. up next, ah. President Bush wraps up a campaign stop in Colorado. Five five under under Marcus. prepares to head to Iowa for a series of rallies in this battleground roll five. state. Roll five, Y5 under. John Kerry also hit the campaign six trail hard, six and as you'll Molly. see, the Democratic candidate is bringing a little star power along roll for six. the ride. Roll six, and Y6 under. Ready to watch the camera one and Kerry's mic. And sends shockwaves through the world of NASCAR racing. Watch the camera one, Kerry. And a pleasant Monday in store, but can't we keep it going through the rest of the five day? Detailed forecast for you coming up. Take three, roll five, ready to go black, take a start to full. Recipes in our studios. News Channel 8 at noon is next. Go black. Kick two star two sound full. All right. Turn over Victor on education. He supported the no at Long John Silvers. You're all right. Set up on the floor. Set us all by MB3 and uh, Sat2 Audio or leader. Victor 11 Audio, whichever and works. Of live super and I'll be under. This is KCCI News Channel 8 at noon. This is all me, 3 and Leonard, Mark, Hart, Mark. With the election just eight Hodge. days away, both Sets President Bush and Senator mics. Kerry prepare to head back to Iowa to try to win this battleground Zoom. state. This is all camera three, both mics, too. Thanks for joining us uh, on this Monday. Judy. President Bush spent this morning Loose campaigning fun. Ray roll five, take five under, roll five. This afternoon, Air take five, Force One heads east for Sets two campaign uh, stops here in Iowa. The president's first stop in Iowa will be in Council Bluffs. Our Western Iowa live Victor 7 audio does all be 3 Victor 7 audio. From Council we'll have screw that up. All right. Trisha? There's no tape here. Well, there is here. a lot of excitement here at this point. You can hear the noise is actually okay, starting uh, to rise a little bit. The band is starting get ready to, to lose practice. Name. And, of course, the people are well, starting maybe. to file in. Lose the president Thanks, is man. expected here with a special guest, we'll be uh, out former the camera New York three Mayor after Rudy this. Giuliani. He's expected we'll to, to arrive about 2.15 this afternoon to a crowd of 11,000 Republicans, or at least Republican supporters in this election. The tickets to this event went on sale Thursday morning and went very fast. Actually, they were free, but you had to go and pick them up. Uh, and all 11,000 gone by Friday morning. They are both from Republicans and Republican supporters from Nebraska and Iowa who are very excited to hear the president's message when he gets here. It's expected to be a message that focuses on homeland security as well as terrorism. Those are the issues that he's been talking about in Greeley this morning. They're sneaking in and a little bit. And the issues he plans yeah, to discuss as he moves throughout these next eight days until the nice. upcoming election. Now, Rudy Giuliani is with him because Beautiful. he is a very important supporter of the war on terrorism. And the people who are waiting in line this morning were Perfect. full expecting to hear a great message from both of those men. Uh, at this point, no protesters outside that we were able to see, but it was pretty chilly as the 11,000 people too. waited out inside, uh, hoping to get in later today. Uh, also, there were volunteers, a uh, couple hundred volunteers helping to work this event, helping to get everybody in place, including us here. Uh, and again, about 2.15 this afternoon, the president is expected to arrive in Nebraska and then make his way over here to Council Bluffs. And after he leaves here, he's, of course, Ready headed to elsewhere Marcus in Iowa. Molly, taking me to. All right, Trisha Moret. Ready camera three and both mics. From Council Bluffs. Thanks a lot, Trisha. And take three both mics. Okay, we'll be in Sioux City and Cedar Rapids on Wednesday. Today he is campaigning in Pennsylvania. And the Brian Andrews shows us now. The Democratic candidate is bringing some high-profile help along with him. Roll six, does all six Less sound full downstream. Less than two months downstream. after heart bypass surgery, former and President Bill Clinton spot. is hitting the campaign trail okay, for Senator John Kerry. Okay, this package runs 105. We're out to uh, Kimmel 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 Kimmel. We're out to Kerry anyone after this uh, downstream. <laughs> So he's the big draw. Loose shot. Loose shot. Yeah, but Kerry's here. Okay. The Bush camp, meanwhile, Brian's says Clinton's presence oh, no, is a sign Brian Kerry has Kerry. failed to energize Democrats. We're out to anyone next. Philadelphia is uh, heavily Democratic, so John Kerry and, and Bill Clinton today are Loose playing spot. to a friendly we have crowd. John Nonetheless, Kerry. the Keystone State is a key state to win. It's 21 electoral votes, though, could go to either candidate because the latest polls show the race to be a dead heat. John Kerry began the last full week of this campaign in New Hampshire, courting voters at a Dover High School. I'm running Downstream. for president and I'm asking for your help these next eight days. And loose spot. With That's this race so inserts. close, Kerry We're knows the final days are Marcus crucial. He'll be concentrating on the all-important swing states and hoping for a big bounce okay, from the Democratic uh, Party's Byer, most Ready, powerful one, weapon. Fox one, Marcus. Brian Andrews, CBS News, Philadelphia. Take me one, Marcus. John Kerry this morning promised that he would hold a World Economy four. Summit if he's elected president. Ready, Kerry says Mike. the summit would be held within the first 100 days of his administration and will be held in Ames, Iowa. Take two 
too much. A battle over who Ready can vote in the November 2nd under. election has Democrats and Republicans at odds. Take Protesters under. shouted and carried uh, signs downstream. outside the Lucas Building in Des Moines today, where and Iowa Secretary Six, of State's or Voter Registration school. Commission was meeting. Camera one, the issue now. was a ruling by Attorney General Tom Miller. Miller said even if someone does not check the box that says they are a citizen, if they sign below swearing they are a citizen, their voter registration can be accepted. In a two-to-two -two vote, Ready the commission five, did not five, change administrative pull. rules to reflect the ruling, but leaders say the AG's opinion still stands. Row 5, this is all 5, That's the pull downstream. Part of this and uh, loose bond. This runs 21 seconds. The IQ is law or state law. And these folks will There's be able another insert to vote here. The, the Attorney General's downstream. opinion does not have the force or effect of law. Loose I mean, bond. Uh, this is a democracy. Next, the uh, there is one. not one statewide elected official Ready who can go out and simply Molly. declare that we are going to ignore federal law. We're going to ignore state law. Take two, Molly. The Secretary Ready of State's office Marcus, is instructing we'll county to auditors to follow the Miller ruling. Take one Iowa Democrats Ready, hope six, they take, take over control six, of the legislature six, in this under, upcoming election. At a news next. conference this morning, Loose if they announce if they win five seats in the House and five seats in the Senate, they can control the legislature. Ready, roll Democrats four, say they want to restore pool. the Iowa Values Fund and put back more money into education. Roll forward, this is all for the sound full downstream. The legislature has done little to Loose advance this runs 20 seconds out, Q is through that. We're out the camera one after this. There's one more insert here, here, and then we'll pan to a box for Bali or for Marcus. They can't have it downstream. both ways. Uh, on one hand, they want to tell the people Loose of Iowa they won't raise taxes. Okay, ready, on the other one hand, they want to go out and promise all kinds of, yeah. of new spending. I think the people of Iowa see through that. Take one, Marcus. Ready Republican to leaders box, are confident they will retain one. control of the legislature. Panda box is on the chief one. justice of the Supreme right, Court has been hospitalized this, with thyroid cancer. Will have Kyron In a statement, over, uh, the court says 80-year-old William Rehnquist yeah. spent the weekend at Bethesda Naval Hospital outside Washington and underwent a tracheotomy Saturday. Rehnquist is Ready, expected two, to be out of the Molly's hospital Molly. and back on the bench when the court resumes its work a week from today. Take two, Molly. A deadly crash Ready, early this morning has claimed the life of a Des Moines woman. 23-year-old Rebecca Waits okay, died in the one car accident one, at about 1 a.m. Police say the driver this, of a car we'll lost Kyron control over, in the 200 block of Army Post Road. Uh, that vehicle That's jumped the curb over, and hit a light pole in the parking lot of an auto parts store. Paramedics took the driver and another passenger to the hospital. They suffered minor injuries. An investigation is continuing this afternoon into exactly what caused that crash. Take one, Rescue crews are searching uh, ready, West Lake Okoboji for two missing people. 31-year-old Matthew Molisek okay. and 12-year-old Kyle Helmers were again. on a barge removing docks and Saturday Judy, afternoon we're out when they started calling for help. Next for Rescue uh, crews one, found Marcus, the barge then, uh, sunk we'll, uh, in 65 feet of water, but they could find no signs of Molisek or Helmers except for some clothing that washed next. on shore. A search with infrared Ready, and night vision equipment failed to turn up any sign of the two. Take me one. A house fire killed Ready, a northern bullet? Iowa man over the weekend. 83-year-old William Spencer died Saturday next, from severe we'll burns. Police officers clip. spotted Judy, smoke coming from his house wife, Friday night, and, and they four. pulled him from the burning home. The cause of that fire Ready, is still under Molly. investigation. Take Lawyers Molly. and judges in the Ready, Dustin Honk and Murder Trial spent the morning start behind clip. closed take doors again. Under, roll five, this story is continuing our look at news from around Iowa this Monday. A federal jury found Honk guilty of murdering five people to keep them from testifying in a drug case. That same jury next. now must Camera decide one, if Honkin should be given life in prison or the death penalty. One of the jurors told the judge her boss would walk by Ray her desk six, and say things like under. kill her or fry him. The judge now uh, has replaced that weather. juror with an alternate will be. and has Ray ordered six, the jury to restart its penalty deliberations. Six, six State officials say they're working to develop guidelines Four's for next. cleaning up methamphetamine labs. Iowa currently ranks first in the nation in meth lab busts. Wow. The procedures used would be used by both hazmat crews Ready and property four, owners four, who four, may discover Molly a continues. tenant has been running a meth lab. Those guidelines should be ready by Pearl the four. end of this year. Quite four under. The parents of okay, an Iowa State University next, student are we'll suing a North Dakota one drug for company for their son's overdose. 22-year-old Michael Babich died in October of 2002 from an overdose of an ingredient found in cough syrup. His body was found in his Judy, dorm room at Friday Hall. Is what you'll a lawsuit need claims the drug company ready, sold Babich the drug months. knowing the chemical would be used for human consumption. Take three, now it's mics. time to turn ready, our attention one, to Brian Carrick to tell us about and a rather nice day outside. Not as good as a weekend, Brian, Judy. but you know, we'll still take it. Yeah, not quite that 72 Loose and spot. sunshine ready, we experienced next, yesterday, but we'll take the above next, normal red. day as we have hey, uh, it going the right bump now. Is after We're at 55, this, uh, we have and you know, a beautiful next. shot there from and our then, uh, webcam. The and uh, bump will be you can five, see there, blue sky, four. plenty of it. Mike, we'll take your bunks will over be to Pella, where again we have blue sky um, and, and a Marcus temperature Mike of 56 degrees, degrees right now. Six and, and we head four. up toward Webster City, just a few cirrus clouds spreading on in, but uh, Webster City, your wind out of the north northwest north north we'll talk first. temperature right now, very pleasant, Ready, 54. So a great fall afternoon in store in your weather Take headlines. Grab. We are 
Expecting okay, that to we're continue out into MBA at least tomorrow next, morning with above normal we'll temperatures through the entire there. five day and, all and some much needed rain. We'll break Take down MB2. rain chances for Ready you to clip. and talk clip about that five day forecast. Boy, guys, we're heading into the end of October mm. here pretty quick. Oh, let us enjoy yesterday yeah. a little <laughs> bit longer. Bottle it up. So perfect. Thanks. Start Brian. clip. Take Amy. Clip Still to come under. on the news. The stop for gas turns into a fiery mess for Ready one family. Six and a six mess under. that's caught on roll six. Five, What six should under. have been an exhibition Ready of four, skating one, four, excellence under. turned into a roll near four. disaster on ice. Wall eight, four, and investigators Ready look to go, for the cause of a deadly plane crash that has rocked the NASCAR racing world. Those stories still ahead. Go black. Take two. Start two. Sound fall. Great job, guys. We have a good You're watching KCCI News Channel 8 at noon. Iowa's news leader with Polly Cooney, Marcus McIntosh, and meteorologist Curtis right, Birch with exclusive live Super Doppler five. weather. This is, is KCCI News Channel 8. Pro 5, this all be 3 5 under my cube. It was Sets a very close call for a family at an Ohio gas station. Zoom, As the father is mics. filling the car up with gas, another vehicle crashed into the gas pump next to him. An explosion and followed that trapped clip, the man's wife the world, and children clip. inside the car. Clips, the story is topping our look at headlines from six around under, the six. Raymond Nichols, Nichols six then burst into action. He ran around his car and safely pulled Four's his next. wife and two children from the car. The entire scene was captured on surveillance wow. video Friday. The driver of the car that caused the explosion fled the scene but was Ready caught. Four, white four 22 year old woman now faces a roll number four. of charges. White four she hit the ice hard and cannot remember what caused her to fall, but Russian figure skater Ow. Tatiana Totmanina says she has no fear of skating and wants to get back on the ice right away. She fell face first during Ready the Skate America six, competition in Pittsburgh over the weekend. There you see it. She lay motionless on My the goodness. ice, and doctors came out to treat her. Six, there five, are 600. confirmed reports coming out of Iraq right. that hundreds of tons camera of explosives were next. looted from yeah, a former three is Iraqi next, military we'll site. Two a UN that. nuclear watchdog agency says it fears the missing explosives may have fallen into the wrong hands. At this point, it is Ready unclear when both the mics. explosives were taken or who has them. Take three both Federal mics. investigators uh, today are combing through two. the wreckage of a plane that crashed in the mountains of Southern Virginia this weekend. As Jennifer Dowling shows us, the plane was owned by one of the biggest names in NASCAR. Pro 5 does all five sound cool. NASCAR is known for uh, high speeds and spectacular dump, crashes, dump. but on Sunday, uh, a crash off the track rocked the racing world. While traveling to the Subway 500, a plane Downstream. owned by Hendrick Motorsports crashed in the mountains of Virginia, five. killing okay, all no 10 people on board. After Four this, of them, it's the Hendrick bump, family members. Struck uh, a steep incline and that the uh, okay, airplane Bob and it, all of its associated parts are confined to an area approximately okay. uh, 200 feet long. Mike, after this, Hendrick the, Motorsports it'll be the bomb, is home it'll to be, some uh, of NASCAR's biggest Mike, names, including Jeff Gordon and, and Sunday's car. winner, Jimmy Johnson. At the request of team owner Rick Hendrick, officials held off from notifying the track crew until after the is race. That was entirely up to the team. Uh, that, okay. that was uh, their decision to make. The crash happened in uh, the wooded area uh, down, about a mile behind downstream. me. Now transportation yeah, officials are going we had, we had about the grim Bob. task of recovering bodies and piecing together Jennifer, the cause of the fatal crash. Loyal race okay. fans are taking the news very hard. I dropped to my knees and started crying. I feel sorry Let for Eric all know he's of close. them. NASCAR officials say they've lost part of their family. Everybody is uh, sort of saying a chance. prayer for the okay. entire That's Hendrick fine. organization right now. Okay. This latest catastrophe shows while danger is a part of racing, there's no accounting for what lurks beyond the track. Okay, clip, Jennifer Donnell in CBS and News, Patrick Kirk's Springs, Virginia. Start your clip, take me clip under. Open Carrick's mind. We well, are currently at 55 degrees outside your metro. Average daytime weatherground. high, 59. We'll take a look Going at the forecast, and right, it black, looks nice. Two, two Even some much-needed rain to talk about next. Let's go black, take two, start two, sound full. All right, set up for weather. During Laura Sands' last okay, day, there, the there would be no prescription drug bill. I'm Chuck Grassley, and I approve this message. KCCI All Storm right, Team 8 is course. your That's only team of four mind. certified meteorologists keeping you safe under an umbrella of protection. Dissolve the Me 3 Care Cube. Well, if you were hoping for some more sunshine, we have Dissolve it for you, too. and lots cool. of it, just a few clouds in the distance, some high cirrus generally running through northern Iowa. We are expecting plenty of blue sky, and actually I believe our temperature, or that last check anyway, was at 55 with that mostly sunny sky, a northeast breeze at 15 and our 50? pressure steady. Our school net site's gonna give Take you a better me. idea of what the temperatures are uh -oh. live. <laughs> 58 in Colo, uh, currently 52 oh, well. in Clarion, 56 Polk City, currently 56 in Oskaloosa. 
Hello, Murray and Bedford. You're both at 57 degrees at this noon hour. Some cool temperatures to the north, some mild air to the south around the region. Oh. We have a weak cold front dropping on through. We're talking 30s from International Falls three minutes, back Brian. through Montana okay. and Wyoming. Coming up on two from minutes Bismarck here, to Sioux Falls, being shown in Minneapolis, but check out the 60s from Milwaukee back down toward Kansas City, and even a 74 degree temperature at this hour right. in St. Louis. Again, we had a cold front dropping on through the plains without fan. Did have a couple of showers up in the Superior the National of, uh, Forest, and back. the Arrowhead of Minnesota, and uh, up into the forests of northern Wisconsin as well, but just cloud cover that came through with yeah. that. And that front will continue its trek toward St. Louis, so the 74 degree temperature you're seeing down there now actually will probably only better itself by a couple of degrees and then St. Louis, Kansas City, and over toward Wichita will also experience a bit of a cool down today. Pleasant, that's what we can expect with high pressure in control. High pressure will slide off to the north and east. We're going to watch uh, several little upper level wrinkles, disturbances in our upper levels race on through, giving us chances for some light showers, especially tomorrow afternoon. And then again, as we progress through your Wednesday afternoon and evening, let's break it down with predictor starch here at 1245. You see, not a cloud in the sky here. There's in one minute to Brian. Just a couple of serious clouds to the north. We watch as the clouds increase from southwest to northeast overnight at 4.30 in the morning. You'll be dealing with a few more clouds. By tomorrow afternoon, a few showers popping up central and north as we head into tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. That rain sticking around, but again, scattered light rain. Looks like our best chance for any collapse of thunder will come in Wednesday night and then again on Thursday night. So get out and enjoy it if you can, or if you have yard work to do, winds calming down just a bit. Out of the north, northeast to 10 to 15, Brian. expecting 63 degrees. Now tonight, we mentioned that increase in the cloud cover, drop back to 45 for your low. He's and clear. Uh, yeah, if you don't get those We're leaves raked up today, we'll to I'd say you're gonna have to we'll wait until next weekend. So we have go a chance for some scattered light rain showers tomorrow afternoon, 60. 65 on Wednesday, chance for a few one, late oh Wednesday nice. night into Thursday. And then again, Thursday night into Friday, but a pretty vigorous cold front Thursday night into Friday. So I think that'll be our best yeah. chance for any thunderstorms. Yeah. Off storms. One all but look Sweet. at Thursday, we're close to 70. I know. I know. Set off still too. We just want the wind to blow and them into the neighbors. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. So that's what I'm hoping. If yeah. I wait long enough, yeah. they'll just that's blow right. away. Yeah. Or the yeah. snow will fall. Yeah. Oh, don't be talking snow just Thanks, Brian. All right, still to come today, are you looking for good, healthy snacks and meals for your family? Our next guest has just the recipe, so stay with us. Go Black. Take two, start two, sound full. All right, three in. Camera three and camera when it two comes to home comfort, the there's kitchen. only one name I trust. All right, Santa Barbara. No one floor. knows. Seth is John Kerry doesn't camera even know. And Molly and the, guest mind. the Republican National Committee is responsible for the Stand content by. of this advertising. And dissolve camera three, both mics cube. If you are like most of us, you're always looking for the next great recipe that is easy and healthy and kids will eat. Well, meet Jill Steinbeck. Ready? She is known as America's healthiest mom, and she's joining us now to Ready? talk about recipes in your new book. Jill, thank you very much Molly, for joining us today. Thank you. How did you become Ready, America's two. healthiest mom? You know, Take actually, two. I was dubbed by Ladies Home Oops, Journal. They dubbed our whole family America's healthiest family uh -huh. and came and out and spent some time. I took them up a few mountains. Well, that was uh, the last they see. wanted to see of me. Is that right? Well, okay, <laughs> well, that'll do it, too. Now, you have a new cookbook that's out. You're going to have a signing tomorrow night but the cookbook is really one. unique because it has a lot of uh, time-saving recipes tell us a little bit about you know it, it is such a uh, uh, fun cookbook because it's the first oh, it's one you make it right quick that's mm -hmm. the secret you everything was the box or a mix or a package that looks something good. already done too. so you just dump and pour that shot but all healthy too. all heart healthy under 25 Perfect. percent fat Beautiful. what are some of the key secrets to that like i Ready, think you were saying three. something about egg substitutes egg substitutes or your low fat or fat free and if you don't like like sour cream you say i don't like the fat free totally Put half and half. That makes it get yeah, the full flavor that you want. Mm. And all, all the two. secrets with Dissolve brownies, two. for example, mm -hmm. that we have There's right here. Uh, Applesauce, apple butter minutes. instead <laughs> of the fats and oils. So I'm just substituting more juicier things, I believe, oh, that right. people are really going to enjoy that give it more flavor. Sounds wonderful. Dissolve now, you three. brought some wonderful ingredients. Okay. Sure. Okay. Stampy, we're right. Right. ready. Tell us about this. Okay, I'm, instead of the oils, for example, I'm using chicken broth. So that's what I have in here. The cornstarch now. You can go two ways with this. You can go with a thicker by putting a little Ready chicken two, broth and two. a little cornstarch at the time right. or you can make it thinner and put all of it in at once it's okay. really what you like and you just stir it in until it's Ready completely um, dissolved in and keep adding as you go now kids can't tell that these are healthy for you, you know right? i call them sneak foods there's two i call them okay. all kinds of foods that you can just sneak in that they don't even know Ready what's three, going in it's the same with my milkshakes and all kinds of Pull things i put the fruits Ready right two. in there with all my walks i put the vegetables the garden Ooh. salad over here 
Good has tip. the broccoli, the cauliflower, just mm -hmm. a little ranch dressing. Mm -hmm. They're like, this is fabulous because they just don't even get it. It's just a secret. <laughs> don't even what they don't know won't Here hurt them. Is Absolutely. Right? <laughs> you know, I think it is a secret. I did a little Parmesan, a little garlic. And again, it is really to your mm. spice. So Ready, three, take I three. find the spicier foods are, the more calories you burn, which we all like more. So Interesting. Yeah, thanks, too. But if you're not a spice Ready person, two. that's okay. Take now, two. myself, Oops. you give me yeah, this Tabasco, two. and I'm going to pour most of it in because that's what I like. Right. I'm oh, a sushi goodness. person, so I like the wasabi types, mm -hmm. same as yes. the Tabascos yeah, and yeah. garlics. Right. They're right. healthy so. for the body. Right. Ready, now, you're three. based in um, Scottsdale, Arizona. Yeah. And you have several other books out. This is not your first. This is actually my 12th. Oh but God. this is my best and because it's a so quick and easy because right. people have what I call ah. what we talked about Ready, three, the grab three. foods in the cabinets mm -hmm. the mm -hmm. things that when you open that refrigerator door it's already prepared all right. on. I double fancy. my recipes which is great and I freeze them okay. so when I have that, that soccer do. game or basketball game or whatever you have out there it's okay. already done now you can see it's Ready, getting two, thicker two. we're going to just move really quickly all ahead right. got the chicken broth now as yeah, it steams up I'm just going to throw the shrimp in there all right now this is raw and cooked shrimp how long do you show them a 30 you know it's only five to eight minutes depending on your That's stove it. so it's very quick till it gets that pink flavor out and it looks like it's nice and cooked after you're done with this you're going to just throw it over okay. here with a little parmesan Let's cheese and wrap. we have the final product right over here that ready three take before, three and it take looks three, wonderful and you are going to have a book says I'll still want does I'll still want you know you're going to tell me about it right Molly it's going to be at Borders Books and Music I know I'm going to say Borders Books but I'm not sure you better be there 6 to 730 so you can meet Jill and pick up the cookbook and they get to taste these which are so fun we're going to have a lot of taste so they can come and taste exactly what's out of the cookbook they're not going to taste this because this is well, you're gonna, here. It's going to be I was going to say, Mark, <laughs> we'll have to keep Mark's away three, from it. Anyway, three. Joel, thank you very much. Thanks. Ready to go black, take to start to you full. We'll be back with more right after this. Go black, take to start to full. Thanks, guys. Nice job. He's across Shut Iowa. Up. Call Dr. Chris Den Outen at 1-800-832-EYES. Dissolve me to set clip source out full. Ugh. Set the dissolved weather graph. We're going to weather graph in this. They're sturdy at the floor. Dissolve the weather graph. I open 63 with sunshine this afternoon. Chances of rain increase tomorrow afternoon. Dissolve Kevin Wallace. And join us tomorrow. Mics. We'll preview the second right. annual Grand Prix. 15 Duke seconds. Ready, start your clip. So dissolve your ME. Start your clip. Dissolve your ME. And Master, it'll be yours here in approximately eight seconds. Ready to go black and Master, it's yours. And go black. Nice. Thanks, everybody.